what matters to you might not matter to me or the other way around but one thing matters to the growth of whole world whole nation and that's innovation to see that innovation we are here in ahmedabad this is matters manufacturing plant inaugurated on 5th april 2025 brand that's redefining the present and reimagining the future and now the plant visit begins nitesh basi and here's ceo of matter mr mohanlal bhai hi thank you for coming down okay so i see a lot of things here but i want you to take us through this which is called aerotomy wall yep it looks cool but what's the story behind like the broken pieces so we actually wanted to showcase what goes into making an electric motorcycle and especially one with gears liquid cooling and what not so for us the biggest thing here is all of this has been designed in india produced in india and that is where we really wanted to showcase to everyone what goes inside the matter era so you guys are relying on in house rather than importing which most of the ev brands are doing but don't you think this is a hindrance for growth because you can do things easily but what's your take on this so for us yes it took us 5 years to kind of build everything out i mean we are our own suppliers in this regard but for us it was very important that we build a product which actually works for indian consumers so like you said it took you 5 years which is a long time and since 2019 you said 2019 i can see it is this the brand story this is our brand journey so in 2019 when we started that was the year when we really figured out what needed solving how to solve it um, 2020 right after lockdown was the first time we really got our um, the first proto the first mule first time when we got the gearbox the liquid cooling things working maybe not working um, 2021 we got into batteries uh, you know really deep 2022 is when we really showcase to the world how and what the matter era looks like 2023 we wanted to get a sense if customers are loving it as much as we do um so with a very positive momentum we started pilot uh, of our manufacturing and uh, dealerships in 2024 and as it would take any plant to go live it took us about 6 odd months slightly long, longer than that to get every system in place to ensure that you know supply supply chains processes everything from a quality perspective were in order and then april 2025 we have actually done the inauguration of the plant and now we're in the ramp up phase a little quick question what inspired you to do things differently because this is whole different level of a bike mm-hmm. things are done differently So for us uh, the biggest one was there were a lot of scooters which are available in the market but India is a country that runs on motorcycles and we didn't really see solutioning happening for motorcycles now i know that motorcycles are fundamentally more difficult to produce than scooters but somebody really had to go down and say hey we know how to solve it and we'll solve it बातें करते करते कहा ले आया लाइक दिस लुक्स लाइक एन एग्जीबिशन इट इज सो फॉर अस दिस इज अ लिस्ट ऑफ थिंग्स यू नो आई वांटेड टू रियली टॉक अबाउट द इंजीनियरिंग एंड द मैन्युफैक्चरिंग दैट नाउ गोज इनटू कंपोनेंट्स सो फीचर्स व्हिच यू टिपिकली सी इन कार्स यू नो योर पैसिव कीलर सेंट्रीज और द कूलिंग सिस्टम दैट वी स्पोक अबाउट ऑल ऑफ दीस कंपोनेंट्स आर 100% मेड इन इंडिया सोर्स्ड इन इंडिया about 80% of the components that go onto the bike are actually within a 25 km radius of us so from a supply chain we are as indian as we could be these are the two most critical components on the vehicle that we completely manufacture in house and i'll be happy to show you in detail what these are but 
This is the actual battery that goes onto the bike. I mean, it's completely cut open and all the stages of manufacturing the battery actually happen at this facility in Ahmedabad. Everything is manufactured, assembled here because for us, the biggest two pieces on which quality cannot be compromised at all. I mean, this is something that has to be precision perfect is the battery and the gearbox. And because of which on the battery side, we are able to offer lifetime warranty is the reason of our attention to detail and our control over manufacturing. So let me show you something most people have actually not seen uh, Mr. from CEO our side. opening the door for us. <laughs> not, not seen uh, much from our side. So this is the part where we actually build our batteries. And to give you a perspective, every single cell which comes into a matter bike is tested, is validated, goes through about seven, eight, ten stages of uh, quality control even before it kind of goes onto the product and for us um, everything even the smallest details like how cells are connected to each other does have a major implication and uh, out here I would just like to kind of show you that this is a battery pack where the cells the bus bars everything has kind of been put together and this is the machine that's kind of really bringing it all together and making a pack so why don't so if you'd like to have a look at the top i mean that's the only viewpoint we'll have now for every vehicle we are able to trace where every single cell was in the journey from a quality standpoint kuch bhi field mein issue hai, we would know exactly what would have happened i got to touch this cell now what next mr ceo because this is interesting so now we are going to be moving towards the power train area where we are going to be assembling motors and gearboxes so, so let's go with the power yep so this is where we actually do make our own motors we make the gear parts we kind of put them together so to give you a sense um, you know, there's a lot of different activities which are going in, which are initial, where you're really assembling um, bearings, you're doing a lot of component insertions. But now that you see from here, this is where electronics, the mechanics, they really come together, where motors are being assembled, uh, the wiring, harnesses, all of that you see. And this is, I mean, you know, the biggest icon of our bike, the clutch, the gearbox, those pieces are visible. For us, this is a place where, you know, it's the real pride and the differentiator and really the solution for the Indian consumer. I mean, giving a product which operates, feels and behaves exactly or very similar to conventional um, motorbikes, you know, you're able to yeah, with the clutch, you are really able to get out of sticky situations. We are able to manipulate torque like nothing else. Most times uh, when uh, vehicles don't perform in the heat or something else, people end up blaming the battery. But more often than not, the root cause actually ends up becoming the motor. What's that noise? Like testing? That's testing. That's the actual sound the gearbox also, the gearbox and the powertrain make. For EVs us... EVs are not really silent guys. They are not. I mean, this is audible. It's You get feedback, you know when motors are at performance. So yes, you do get a lot of feedback. But um, again, very similar to all the quality checks that we do. We ensure every single powertrain that goes onto the vehicle is tested we are able to understand what's going on before putting it onto the bike. But also I see you guys took five years, so definitely you are here to stay longer for very, very long. I also assume you will have bigger plans, more plans, more products lined up. But how much do you think this architecture, if we call it an architecture, yep. you can 
do the innovation or you know you can have new products on basis of this with a very little amount of rework is so it possible it is the the motor and the gearbox platforms are quite scalable uh we could go to as low as about 125 cc with the same architecture uh on the upper side we could do about a 250 cc as well so that's the kind of 150 to 250 cc is the architecture on which this is done but for us more than the platform itself the learnings and the feedbacks that we have gotten really have allowed us to look at what is right what is wrong and to be fair future products uh, future generations we are looking at doing a lot more innovation in this space so power train is assembled what next i guess bike yes uh, we'll walk towards uh, vehicle assembly line and you know this is where everything that you saw as far as components and parts are considered really come together Mr Mohal please enlighten us so again you saw all the parts now they are all being put together and in the classical sense the first thing that is being going in is the power train you have the wheels a lot of it coming together and this is also interesting at least for me well <laughs> <laughs> the lines operate uh, and continuing forward we are literally looking at every single component being assembled every wire coming in again from a quality perspective there's a lot of checks and balances that are happening as the line is progressing the intent again here is that nothing should slip out from our hands which could potentially cause issues out in the field for that's us that's a really nice intent but i want to know how do you keep this skilled man force aligned with the automation process so well the good thing is uh, gujarat has a lot of auto industry we have a lot of people who are already trained and for us the biggest benefit is that we've designed it we have figured out how to put it together that's the real best part here and what's this so these are our again you can see inline checks and quality systems this is the final monitoring machine this is what's threading everything that you saw as far as components and everything is considered onto that one final vehicle So at this stage right behind you is where the bike is going to be finished going to be checked everything is put into place and from here we actually take it through a couple of rigorous trials oh, so the, thank god because i wanted to ask you do you guys just sell it right from here <laughs> no actually it goes through two very specific tests so we can i, I can show you this one here so this is where we do the first uh, performance test of the product we ensure that everything from a performance perspective does get checked sorry does get checked and well you seeing it for yourself braking acceleration top speed the basics of the battery the power train the way the suspension are working most of those things get the first cut check here is there any limit like or let's say a benchmark for how much kilometers of how much how many minutes do you check this bike for so for us for? this is all about doing performance checking the kilometers piece is something that we do outside where we actually drive the bike for 25 kilometers to ensure that everything is how it's supposed to be torture test tak laate laate lagta hai garmi mere sath torture kar diya and though is so hot right now it is it is and then again I'm the bad dust torture a lot of uh, I mean the the heat the liquid cooling all of these I mean uh, the the torture is real But um, 
as you are able to see i mean we do a 25 kilometers of torture here trying to mimic real world conditions be it your potholes be it your rough roads be it your slopes inclines just trying to ensure that you know every product that goes out is unapologetic so would you like to get on to a bike and experience this for yourself if you insist <laughs> i think you should <laughs> let's do that that was intense very intense really good that you guys make your bikes go through such intense testing so that your and customers might yeah. not have to suffer we, we we do call it a torture try right? i mean it's really supposed to shake you up uh, completely but uh, now yeah. that i've gone through that torture test i've gone through each and every innovation of yours i feel this bike has so much potential this company has so much potential Thank now you. anybody who's going to have a test ride any bike lover would be really going nuts over it but also let's say there are floods of orders can you guys manage it so well this facility does have a capacity of 120000 ek lakh 20, bisa sir per annum so i think uh, for the next year or so we should be okay but uh, depending upon how the next 12 months go we might have to look at expansion and a newer facility from here on out all right uh, so you guys are giving lifetime warranty on the battery yep so much promises so it's really important to know the future plans the vision where do you see yourself after 5 years so after 5 years i think uh, we definitely look at ourselves as being a dominant player in the electric motorcycle space um, not only in india we would at that time be outside of the country as well we are looking at playing in the 200 cc and lower segment so we will be introducing products which are at 150 125 cc equivalents um, year on year on year so that's something that we intend to do and also if we see 5 years ahead what do you think you as a company or as a founder will be most proud of making that change in the ev space with the matter i i think for us it is going to be all about uh, people loving our products especially the gearbox the convenience the familiarity the way we do our charging the 5 amp socket se kar rahe that people should remember us for real problem solving is what would make us most proud that was very insightful for me and i hope for the audience as well i wish you the luck and hopefully we'll see you in your new facility after some years yeah thank you so much thank you for coming down pleasure is all ours so guys if you liked it if this was insightful for you insightful enough for you you can definitely subscribe to us like the video and to learn more about matter description mein links hai go through it